exercise my life. I only started leaving my house when I started comedy last year. And now I've actually got hypersensitive eyes to light. Thanks, mate. Um, yeah, that's really if I've done my stage performance. Because I only just started looking up. I was looking down for like half the year last year. I also like obsessed over the microphone for three years before I got on stage. I would just sit there and watch what everyone did with their microphone. I could never take it out until once I did. Never again. That's so why I need it. I need it for support. I feel like it's my third leg, the tripod. But um, yeah, so my name is Jane O. I am um, had to put exclamation on the end because you know I'm not Asian. Um, and that's my little intro because I felt like, you know, I think I do a little intro, pretty get it out there. But um, yeah, I've been having quite a fucked up time lately. I have been in the hospital, and that was a fucking reality check on how lonely I am as a one person. I saw all these people, their husbands, come visit them and shit. I was like, fuck, maybe I should get a husband. <laughs> I've never wanted a husband in my whole life. But now, I'm like, who the fuck is going to come visit me when my mum cuts it? I'm like, no one. And I'm just going to be that sad, pathetic person crying. But, um, yeah. And then I was like, well, I'm going to get kids too. This is why no one else is, like, lonely. Because they have their tribe. I just don't want to push kids out and ruin my canal. <laughs> That's true. Um, yeah, and yeah, so I was in hospital, had to get a COVID test. Well, I got it once before, and wow, that was yeah, the deepest penetration I had had this year. <laughs> so I thought, until this COVID test, you know they've fucking changed it now? Yeah, it's double prong. Double prong up your nose, like two sides. It was already too far down one side before. And now, yeah, double prong. It's like, oh, never had ZP before. <laughs> Cross that off the back of this. Um, yeah, and my, yeah, my whole family actually just calls me Janel. I feel like that would be my great porn name. <laughs> and um, yeah, my brother, he doesn't even call me Jane anymore. They call me Jane for like over 20 years. He just calls me anus. <laughs> like, and I respond to it. I'm just so used to it. But these people have never had anal in their life. They're so fucking straight. They don't even watch porn. I feel like the dirty boy sitting at the table. But um, yeah, so one day I was explaining fisting to my <laughs> sister who had never watched porn. Um, I could not believe she never heard of it. She was like, how does it get in there? I'm like, dude, it's all about the duck. <laughs> the entry. She was like, still like, what? And then her son, who was also <laughs> sitting at the table, but I mean, he was like, one or something. I'm like, surely I don't say what I'm talking about. Starts doing duck hands. <laughs> yeah, duck annual entry hands, whatever. Every time he breaks me now. That's what it does. <laughs> yeah. Um, and yeah, so I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah. Someone tell me what I was going to say. Oh. oh, can I tell you a story about a duck though? I used to have this best friend, Frank the duck. This is why I love Frank. I met Frank. It's like, yay, you can join the one syllable name club. Because, you know, I'm Jane. It's, yeah, it's If anyone else has one syllable name, we're looking for a bear. <laughs> but, um, yeah, the duck story, Frank. Oh my god, he used to come across the road and hang out with me and watch Dr. Phil <laughs> on the couch. I was like, he's so fucking awesome. But, um, yeah, then he just stopped coming one day and, yeah, I wrote him, mate. <laughs> oh.